Alright man, peace. Please like, comment, and subscribe to the channel. It'll be greatly appreciated. So let's talk a little bit more. I just made a video earlier pertaining to the situation of Chicago and the hellfire they're in. It's not only Chicago. It's most inner cities, most hoods, most projects. It's corrupted and compromised. The leader of mostly every gang in America is in cahoots with law enforcement because nothing is gonna go, nobody owns the streets. Who owns the streets is the government. So most of these people that's higher up in the gang is in somewhat of a cahoots with the government. And if you don't believe me, a new movie just came out, a new series called Raising Canaan from, from 50 Cent. Where do you think he got that concept from? You think it's just for the movie? Canaan's mother and Joey Badass as playing the other drug dealer. Joey Badass is in cahoots with Omar Epps, which is a detective. They tell you every day how it goes. So if you feel like you're going to be in a gang, running the streets, putting out drugs, selling this, selling that, and you are not co in cahoots with law enforcement that knows what's going on and put it in organized crime, you will never win in the streets. Not only you will never win, you're playing to lose. Let me say that again, you're playing to lose because what you gotta understand is that people don't play, especially when it comes to the root of all evil, which is money. Does money have spells on it? There's reason why it's green, because our chakra points is green. Our heart chakra is green. This is why we love money. Look it up. We have chakra points. The lowest level is, I think, red, then orange. Pay attention. not going to be in this world thriving playing with the devil if you don't know how it works you cannot win and it's the same thing that goes for the drill culture this new modern age drill culture and the hot girl summer don't you see that a lot of females is getting killed too, dying too. Don't you see in the drill culture, a lot of people is dying with waging wars from both sides. There's always have to have two parties to play. Two consist um two con um testants in New York, the wolves versus the chose. And it lead over to other little gangs coming out and doing their own little thing. Every borough wanna make a stamp for themselves. Don't talk about Chicago because those are the, pro the pioneers of what is going on. Chief Keith is responsible for a lot of death, even though he don't really pick up a gun and kill himself and he wasn't a murderer like King Vaughn and, and stuff like that. He's still responsible for a lot of death. He pioneered this shit. It's not only him, but the selected few that got chosen. Yeah. The enemy knows what they was doing to give these kids money to promote this. And it blew up. Now everybody want to be in the drill culture. Now little Dirk has taken over. He has blonde his hair. And he is thriving off of death. King Von, you know. Even though King Von, life, he lost his life tragic, he was also a savage once upon a time. And when karma comes around, they don't spare you. They don't care how you view this person because you like this person because you're socially... It grew upon you to socially accept him. But he was doing a lot of barbaric things too. Just look at the documentaries. Pop Smoke. Let's talk about him for a second. He's from Brooklyn, Canarsie. He created a movement. What happened? Didn't he 
it was a lot of suspicions around his death about being backdoored and this and that and this and that. You have to wake up. And you have to wake up and understand that life is not a game. Be careful what you share your energy with. Be careful where you share your energy with. Now, when people would be surprised, I, I swear to God, YouTube is weight for death. Because that's money. Some people utilize it for the greater good to be heard. But everything is a learning lesson. If it's death, it's a learning lesson. It's to make you think. In Chicago, there's a lot of bloodshed. There's a lot of underhand shit going on. It comes down from the politician. It's not the lower levels. This is what you associate with because this is what most people live day to day. But when it comes to the politicians and the people in the office and the people that's behind the scenes that's really pulling the strings behind the curtain, those are the ones that's organized hates. Those are the ones that organize shit. Every month, somebody famous from the drill culture, life is sacrificed. Last month, wasn't it um, this dude, what is his name? The light skin dude with the dread that got shot coming out of, uh, I think, Cook County. Don't you find that ironic? Nobody got caught up for that. And if they do get caught up, you will never know what really happened. <laughs> Stay tuned to part two.